Roddy Tops! But I left you back on Spiderweb Island! Uh, what was my voice from Roddy Tops? I didn't want to miss out on the fun, so I followed you. Look, we both have matching costumes. I'm so happy about this. Now we can be princesses together. Oh. Roddy, we gotta get out of here fast. You know we've been kidnapped and are forced to stay here against our will. Okay, I'll go. <laughs> but I'm keeping this outfit. She's like the most content person ever. <laughs> She's like Setsuna, but a like zombie. Yeah, Setsu but I mean, she's been around for way longer than Setsuna. Oh, well, we are yeah. speaking of Setsuna from Fire Emblem Fates. Which is like the best female character from Fire, Fire Emblem Fates. Is that right? She's awesome, I love her. Wow, I can't believe I killed the Cackle Bat from here. Oh, but I don't have my lamp! I'm like, there's a catch, there's a catch, there's a catch. I don't have my lamp. I can't believe I have to avoid these guys, too. Does he ever turn around? No, they just keep staring at you. Oh, shit. Maybe you have to beat them up. Do you think... Oh, that sounds like a risk. Oh, they don't care. Princess, it's you! Okay! So they're just stupid. So I think I'm supposed to find more keys and, and rescue everybody. Ah! Oh, risky! Um... Risky, is that you? Who else would it be? I came looking for you and instead I found this place! These simpletons mistook me for some silly princess and locked me in here! Same here! I'll pound those imbeciles into fish paste when I get my hands on them! We're wasting time, let's go! Okay, so I, I guess I need another key for Sky. I just missed out on getting a key somewhere. I feel like this is all just an excuse for fan service. Shh. Hey, don't you shush me. I will bite you. You would do that anyway. I know. But in a way, you won't enjoy it. <laughs> <laughs> I saw the keyhole. I just need to find the key. There's... Oh, my God. This place is a maze. There is so much to explore here. Did that girl seriously kick me off the, the chain rope? What the fuck? So, are these people just mistaking any woman that, like, walks into their castle as the princess? And they're just like, we're just gonna put you in some skimpy outfit that our princess used to wear. Pretty much. I think that old man's just a pervert. I just want to see all the pretty ladies. 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 Oh, if you liked it, then you should have put your thing in it. Uh, whoa, hey! Oh, don't do it. Don't, no. No. <laughs> no. That's, that's the way I always, I always say that. So. No. <laughs> if you like it, then you should have put your thing in it. Uh, but uh, that, uh, that can have some really uh, bad uh, 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 implications, though. So uh, please please consent first. Yes. Before putting your thing in it. Keep it sane, keep it safe, keep it consent. And by consent, you mean I, you ask once. You don't pester them until they say yes. That exactly. is not consenting. That is coercing. That One is no different. means no. It's not, a, it's not one of those, like, was that? Four no's and a yes still means yes. No. <laughs> was that, Oh, someone had a thing of that, too, where it's like reading Donald Trump quotes a Zap Brannigan from Futurama. Oh, my God. That's fantastic. Isn't that perfect? I need to see. Is this a video? No, it's just uh, it's a concept. Oh, my gosh. It's like reading YouTube comments. As We're going to build a wall and Mexico is going to pay for it. <laughs> <laughs> you make another country pay for that shit? What the fuck? And then, and then you have Kiff there, too. Dude, like freaking... Sir, I don't think... <laughs> I can't really do a kiff I voice. mean, fucking Teddy Roosevelt didn't make, like, Panama pay for the Panama Canal. I mean, yeah, he, like, did some pretty shady shit to get the Panama Canal, but at least America fucking paid for it. At least as far as I know. I might be getting my history wrong. I, I honestly have no clue. But, I mean, Teddy Roosevelt was a man with a shit ton of charisma, so... There are people who would argue Donald Trump is as well. Hell no. That man can't take a photo worth shit. I mean, charisma is more than that. Mmm, you gotta have charisma to take a good photo. <laughs> okay, okay. Unless you're drunk, and then, like, nobody's photo's good looking when you're drunk. Is this the last key I needed? Hey, Sky. Is this Sky? I thought it was Sky. Sky, they caught you too? What are you doing here? I flew here to find a cure for Joe. What's your excuse? I'm here with, uh. Fine, don't tell me. Let's just find a way out of this madhouse and put some clothes on for crying out loud. Uh, how am I supposed to walk in these shoes? It doesn't even look like we're wearing shoes. Oh my gosh. Was that everybody? So now what? Now what? Now something special? 
Mm -hmm. Nope, just fan service. Uh, what if I go this way? Oh, hey, it's Save Dude. Save Dude! Help me save the game! Ooh, hey, heart. Uh. Uh, it looks like the wrong way. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, not that way! Gasp! Oh my, the princess! They're just so, like, celebrity stunned. Alright. There you are! We should be able to operate this contraption if the four of us work together! They're not even going to question my relationship with Risky right now? We're not heavy enough! Nope. Although Blondie here does make for some excellent ballast. I don't even know what that word means. What does that mean? Ballast? Ballast. Uh, fuck if I know. Uh, where is my phone? Do 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 do. And sorry guys, this is really important. I need to know the definition of this specific word. Siri. Oh. Don't be a bitch. Siri, <laughs> define ballast. I don't think Siri's working. Uh oh. Uh oh. My phone's crashing. Oh, jeez. <laughs> and then I dropped it. I think I break it. Define ballast. Alright, Siri will come up with that in like five minutes. So let's keep going first now. Excuse me? You probably weigh as much as a lead balloon. Or two. Sigh, can we at least try to work together? Whoa. Okay, Siri is, isn't working right now. Fuck you, Siri. Define ballast. Just type it in. Okay, uh, so my foot, my, my Siri is not working right now at all. I've never had this happen. I won't work with her, but for you, sure. Me? Aren't you the brain eater? What? Not you. Her. Ugh, the noise. This is why I work alone. All right, you lovers, Paul. Yes, ma'am. Oh, that worked, I guess. I don't know how we're pulling when we have no momentum since we're- It worked! Okay. Oh, okay, so I looked it up. It's a heavy material such as gravel, sand, iron, or lead placed in a low- Placed low in a vessel to improve stability. Alright. If you want to make something- So probably they should just say she has big ass. Yeah. Uh. You're a scary lady. Oh, here she comes. She's a scary lady. Come on, let's all rush in and pummel these imbeciles! No, we should sneak past them quietly. I want to distract them with a fan dance. Sorry, I'll take a look. That's a weird statue. Princess, you've arrived at last. Behold, a glittering statue of your vast magnificence. What? That's supposed to be me? Ah, uh, but yes, it is your exact likeness. Oh, dear God. But lo, do my eyes deceive me? Princess, there are four of you! But each of you looks perfectly identical to this humongous, titanic, rotund, corpulent, and bulgingly beautiful, pleasantly plump statue! I think this guy's just blind. Probably. That's it! Ring his throat! Oh, there's the princess. Oh. What's this? Princess! There you are! Where in the world have you been? It's been over 30 minutes! Oh, dear God. Were you at the store that whole time? You silly Billy. This? I can't... People, hear me! Our princess has returned at long last! From the store! Thank you all. Truly, you have saved our people. Sorry about the mix-up. Believe me, this happens all the time. Oh, my God. This is awkward. I should return your garments. They give you this golden pickaxe in honor of your great deeds. Oh, now you can, like, dig through shit. Oh, maybe. Uh, lead us out of your adventures from now on. Wait, is this is the fun part where I get an item. Got the golden pickaxe. Yeah, maybe I can, like, just dig through everything now. That'd be cool. That I, that was was I, can't, I didn't even get to talk to the princess. Golden pickaxe. No, it's I think it's really just for the, the desert puzzle. It's not for everything. Mm, lame. It's just for this part. What's this? A golden pickaxe on the princess? Can I have it pretty please? Yeah. Such incredible craftsmanship. We'll have this cleared away lickety split. You gave the golden pickaxe. 
and I, I'm assuming there are sound effects going on right now that I can't hear. Wow, with these runes out of the way, I can see all the way to the horizon. And look at these chubby green birds. Uh, ah, birds. those aren't birds. The monsters run! Uh, actually, I do want to go back to the, 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 the temple I was just in because I forgot there, there was a cackle bat in there that I killed, so I can, I can suck it up now. Yay, suck it. <laughs> do, 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 do. Yeah, suck it. Do, 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 do. It's nice to have all my shit back. Suck it. Suck it good. Okay, that's enough of that. What? What? I want to suck it. Okay, you can. Wait. Later. Later. <laughs> you are free to pass. All right, thanks. Sorry for the mistake. Sorry for the mistake. Ooh, jars. Who knows what wonder Break is them in all. them? I think there was a heart in there. See, now you understand the appeal of it. Oh, I know the appeal of jars. Break all of them. Okay, now where's that cackle? Aha! So that's cool, they stay dead. They just become like floating thingies of dark magic. That's that's nice. I wonder if there's areas in this like place that I missed where there's like items and stuff. I don't know if I want to explore that right now, but uh, maybe there are. Because there, there's, I think there's areas I didn't get to go to. What I do you say? I want that statue. Behold, our princess has returned. Shut your yap! <laughs> oh, that's fantastic. I love it. That's pretty good. Okay, where's the area I'm sneaking? Because there was an area, like, when I finally got past that sneaking part that took me forever. There was, like, an area I could have gone to and didn't. I think there's a shortcut over here. Oh, wait. This takes me just back to the very beginning of it. Although I could probably free reign explore it now with my items. Mm, let's give it a once over. Right, we uh, went to a market uh, yesterday and we got some dates and uh, figs. Yeah. They're good. It was this... Uh, I've never tried either before. They're delicious. It was this Middle Eastern market. It was, like, they, yeah, it was a Mediterranean it was like, um, market. Yeah, it was really interesting because like, what it had was like your typical like gas station type stuff. And then like tons of like random Middle Eastern like food type things. Like they had like, you know, like Turkish coffee... And various different types of Middle Eastern tea. And they, and and they were really they, nice. I had to oh, yeah. I had to pee really bad, and they let me use their employee bathroom. So, yeah. So that was they were super nice. Yeah. And the food was good that they had there. Like I've never had. Oh yeah, like because we were buying the dates, I'm like, oh, I'm gonna try dates, and he like opened a package for me and was like, oh hey, try one. I think first. it was already open. Though, oh yeah, he was he was already, he was already like snacking on them. them. I think yeah. He's like, oh hey, try one. And uh, yeah, it was really neat. Yeah, it was super cool. I wish there were more like places where we live where like the food is more diverse like culturally because like i you mean well, in, the t in the town we're living yeah, in yeah in the town we're living yeah in. because like i wish they had like an asian market i wish they had like a mediterranean market i wish there was like more variety for food stuff because i don't know about you but american food's not that exciting i'm well it depends I to me know. on what what you're defining as american food usually like your typical stuff like pork chops and pizza and see pizza is very exciting for me well okay so. like hamburgers and hot dogs and i like hamburgers meatloaf i mean i love meatloaf don't get me wrong that's a food that like i never really got to have growing up and i enjoy it a lot but like you know your traditional american foods roasted chicken stuff like that it's like and while those things are really good and I love them, I love just like Mediterranean food, Indian food, Asian food. I love most exotic foods. So, yeah, it's just kind of sad that we can't explore that in our community as much. I mean, yeah. the most exotic we get is like... Chinese? Yeah, well, no, like the one Thai food place we have, there's one Indian restaurant, which is kind of okay. Well, and the and then well, just and the, a and the, shit ton of Mexican food, which Mex Mexican food is fantastic. Yeah, aren't there it's, four Mexican restaurants yeah, here? Yeah, but so. there, there's only like one authentic one. Like all the rest are just your typical like Tex-Mex generic shit. That's true. I mean, it's good food, but still like... It'd be nice to have more, like, like Puerto Rican food or Polynesian food or just it's more diversity, damn it. Well, I didn't, th I didn't see anything special, so I'll just meet you guys in the next episode back at the new area that we opened up. I was hoping I'd get to talk to the princess, but I guess not. So we'll see you guys next time.